shalom the lord bless you i welcome you in the mighty name of jesus now this word is very specific and to the person that this word is about the lord says there is a strong man in your household there is a strong man in your household i'm gonna go deeper as we go further if you're yet to join our amazing family please hit that subscribe button turn on your notification bell so whatever i post you will be notified i am happy to have each and every single one of you here today i pray the lord bless you guide you and protect you now just to let you all know we will be doing a lot of praying we will be doing a, most of these videos that are, that are beginning to that i'm going to be putting out there is going to do it's going to be more about prayers because i've come to understand that there are a lot of attacks going on out there and we start we need to start you know we need to be a step ahead we need to be a step ahead by praying so to the person i am talking to you have a strong mind in your household now when i say a strong man what do i mean by that somebody that is practicing witchcraft somebody that is making sure you do not succeed it's more like a wordlock that is, I don't know if I'm pronouncing right, a wordlock, a witch doctor. That is what I mean by a strong man, somebody that is into witchcraft. And this person has seen that you have a very bright destiny, you have a very bright future. They try to bring you closer to them in order to initiate you. But being a child of God that you are and being as prayerful as you are, they did not succeed but they came to realize that if they cannot make you to join them they are going to make sure that they bring you down that you don't succeed so this strong man has been you know doing evil incantation against your life like they know that you have a very bright future right so they are fighting that from manifesting this person is seriously against you and is seriously planning demonic stuff against you to make sure that you don't succeed, to make sure that your star doesn't shine bright. To make sure that your star doesn't shine bright. If you watched the previous video I posted, I said something about each and every single one of us here on earth has a star and that star represents you. When your star is dim, know that there is something wrong. Either there is an evil manifestation or an evil incantation going on. That is why your star is dim. Remember in the Bible when the three wise men were trying to locate Jesus when Jesus was born. The only way they could locate him was that they followed the stars. And the star was like so shine, so bright that they were able to tell that if we follow this star, we are going to find jesus through following this star you have a star and this strong man in your life has located your star and it's affecting you it is affecting your success success it is affecting your breakthrough it is affecting your manifestation and they have put it they have brought it upon themselves to make sure that you don't succeed since you refuse to join their evil practices but you are a child of God and you did not stumble across this video by mistake. We are going to pray. Any strong man that is holding your star, that is holding your blessings, we pray for total destruction in the mighty name of Jesus. Type that in the comment section. A close mouth is a close destiny. Say every strong man that is holding my star, that is holding my destiny, that is holding my blessings, we pray for total destruction upon them in the mighty name of Jesus. Wherever you are, open your mouth and begin to pray. Heavenly Father, King of King, Lord of Lord, I pray for your children watching me right now. Any strong man in their life, I pray for total destruction in Jesus' mighty name. Any strong man in their family, I pray for total destruction in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Pray this prayer before you go to bed. And I also want you to be aware that when we make certain prayers like this it comes with a lot of attacks because these prayers touch touches base with heaven and it affects them okay every time you pray it hits them every time you pray it hits them so they are going to try to come back to you they're going to try to come back in a double force to affect you either to inflict you with sickness either to you know 
cause something to happen to you that is why you have to pray consistently okay and i want you all to also put me in your prayers because i'm making all of these prayers on your behalf and when these people you know discover the source of your prayers they are going to attack you know like the ministers of god you know suffer a lot from stuff like this i'll just put it that way um i want you to be prayerful and just know that prayers like this come with a lot of attack we are in our warfare season we are going to fight any evil destruction any evil prayer any evil manifestation that has been made over our lives any strong man we are going to pray for their total destruction in the mighty name of jesus amen if you're yet to give this video a thumbs up please do so hit the subscribe button turn on your notification bell so whenever i post you will be notified and please be prayerful and always remain blessed. Share it to somebody that you think might need it. I'll see you next time. Please, please, please be prayerful. There is a lot going on out there. There is a lot going on out there. And prayer is the key. Prayer is the key. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.